first thing first, it is very important to make sure you are in the correct stance. Notice how I'm making sure that my feet are pointed outward. I'm over the dumbbells slightly. They are pretty much at the center of my feet. If I had a bar right here, it would be in a similar position. All right, and this is how you wanna start. You wanna start pretty much getting your body into the right position in order to force your knees outward when pressing up. It's very important when the sumo deadlift that you squeeze every bit of your lower body when pulling up. You need to squeeze your glutes. You need to make sure your chest is out and pull your hips forward. This is gonna allow you to get the most benefit out of the sumo deadlift. Now, when you're bringing the dumbbells back down to the ground, it is not necessary to be in the upright position, but you do need to make sure you do not tilt over too far. Keep your head in that neutral position in line with your core, in line with your shoulders. You can tuck your chin, but not too much. It's very important to drive through the heels. You will not feel any of this movement if you are not using your full lower body. You are not pulling the bar up or the dumbbells up with your upper body, which is why you do not want to tilt over too far. So the better that you get with this movement, you'll be able to stay in a more upright position, giving your lower body every bit of tension it needs and squeezing through the movement, squeezing those hamstrings, those glutes, tightening up that core and getting the best out of this workout, out of this exercise, sorry. So like I said, make sure you keep your knees pointed outward. Try not to cave your knees in when pulling up. If you are doing that, that means you are using too heavy of a weight and you need to lower the load. This movement is gonna help with your posterior chain, all right? So if you are struggling with any mobility, you need to make sure that you're using the proper stretches before this exercise in order to help you bring these dumbbells up off the ground because it's not easy. But this will help you with your posture. Make sure your hip flexors are intact. Make sure your core is tight. Make sure your hamstrings are loose. Make sure your quads are being flexed. All of this is important when performing the sumo deadlift. This is the ultimate lower body glute exercise.